I did complete the ensemble. Now let's take the ensemble. You got the costume. And we are going to put it on and do the thing now. Wait, where? why is the shirt still there? Whatever, I don't care. <laughs> hey, the amazing Rando. Watch Rando the Great construct sets with his very mind. <laughs> What's up, Rascals? Welcome back to the Norwood Suite, and I believe this is our final episode for this, and uh, now... Oh. Ringo Starr just up and left. Alright, cool. And he locked us in. Okay. He locked us in?! No! Even the secret passage is, is not there, is it? Nope! So how are we gonna... How are we gonna deal with this, hmm? Shh, let's explore. Maybe there's... Maybe there's another. Cause this place is rife with secret passages. Oh, that's a creepy image. Oh, look at you! Oh, okay. Missing. Last seen, July 4th, 1983. Okay. What does that have to do with any- all of this? This is like- this is creepy craziness. Where do I go? Um, this way? Into the light? Okay. Okay, it's not- maybe- maybe- maybe this is a fabrication or, or something, I don't know. Hello? You want me to read that? Okay. You've been following him around the whole time. After hours work variance permit. <clears throat> oh, hey. A QR code. Wonder what that one says. Uh, if you guys go ahead and find out before I do, let me know in the comments. But, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm probably going to check out the QR code, see if it does anything. But, the Norwood Hotel, Floors, All, Cosmo D Studios, LLC... Description of work. The Norwood Suite was made possible with the assistance from NYU Game Center Incubator, Alliance Digital Media, and scores of the playtesters. Special thanks goes out to Shannon, Dilla, and Clara, blah, 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 all these people, and the state of New York. Oh, that's cool. Questions or complaints can be sent to Cosmo D at Cosmo D.net. I don't think I have any complaints. I have some curiosities and questions, perhaps, but uh, no complaints. This place is pretty awesome. This game is pretty awesome, and I kind of want to uh, play that other game that the stories from Off Peak. And maybe I should get back into Off Peak and see if I can get to the end of that one too, because I never did. I feel, feel kind of weird about that, but whatever. On to the basement! Let's get down to that party, yo! I bet you they'll let us right in. Will you let in? Decent costume. You can pass, bub. Thanks, Logan. Ooh. Okay, we're saving. Okay, cool. An elevator to the basement floor. Sweet! Now we can give that, uh, CD from Muriel! And... Okay. These is some funky costumes that these guys have. And giants, too. Whoa! What is that? Excuse me. Gonna w get past the wiggle and cheddar butt. And, uh, examine this. Ooh, I am the great and powerful Oz! Neat. Okay, so there's nothing back here. It's all right there. It's kind of a waste of space if you ask me. But hey, everyone's having fun, so whatever. Have I seen you before? DJ Bogart is on the clock, so no interruptions. So you're DJ Bogart? Excuse me, sir? Okay, um... DJ Bogart is at the peak of his set. We won't let you interrupt. Not a chance, bub. Oh, really? Hello. You a tall boy. Either that or I'm short. Could be. 
These guys are real tall boys. They be giants. Should we? Let's cause some mischief. You got you. You're not. You're gonna not gonna stop me. You're just gonna watch me menacingly as I do this and this and uh, maybe a little of this. As some of the people are noticing and not li uh, not liking the non music. And some of this! Ha ha! Hee hee ho ho! Hi buddy! How you doing? Hi Pierre! What's up? Oh! He punched me out! He, he punched my lights out! That was violent! I don't appreciate that! Hello? Is that the end? Nadia? Yes, DJ Bogart. Oh god, she's a Medusa. She's got snakes in her hair, I think. Who the hell is this? No idea, DJ Bogart. Dottie, who is this? A guest for the night. Checked in earlier this evening. You certainly don't look like a guest to me. How would you know? You were in your office the whole fucking night. As much as I like your outfit, stranger, you ruined my party. Utterly. Why are you letting troublemakers into the hotel again, Dottie? Our guest had a voucher, Bogart. I'm not gonna just turn away guests. Tonight was no vacancy, Dottie. You knew that. No vacancy, schmegancy. I know you always leave a few rooms open for... Hey, remember that pay cut we were talking about? You really gonna cut my pay over this? The contract you signed binds your pay scale to your job performance. Plus, I get to dock you 50 bucks for every random act of sass. I think... I think we're there, Dottie. You've given me no choice. A damn piece of paper I signed 15 years ago, still biting me in the rump. As interesting as this is... I was right to insist on a handshake agreement with you, Nadia. Ah, a demo CD, eh? Let's see that. From Muriel, eh? Muriel. So she dropped you off here, eh? I should have guessed. You know she's banned for life from this place, right? Why is that? None of your concern, Dotty. Guards, kindly remove this stranger from the building at once. Oh, wait, wait, no! Hold up, Nadia. If the CD is from Muriel, I'm gonna have to listen to it. Yeah, since it's from Muriel. Why is Dottie... Why is... Why is Nadia the only one that doesn't like Muriel, huh? Come on, no means no, come on. Oh. It's in my best interest as a professional selector of... To field new music. Especially if it's from Muriel. Muriel must be some real important person in these guys' circle of musical friends. Yeah, Bogart, you, you're going to want to hear this. Hmm. Okay. Come up to my room, stranger. We'll listen to the CD together. Uh, not a good idea. Look, I'll play another 48-hour marathon party next weekend, okay? Just get off my back, Nadia. Don't say I didn't warn you, GJ Bogart. I've got plans for you, stranger. You're going to owe me for this. Let me take the old lift up to my private suite. Meet me there. We shall listen to this CD together. Meet me upstairs in a minute. Okay, cool. Bogart thinks he can hightail it out of here now that he's got that Blue Moose sponsorship. He made a handshake agreement with you, Nadia. He can walk away anytime. Oh, really? That 360 D... That 360 deal he made with Blue Moose Energy Drinks, I wrote it, which allowed me to make a side deal on the merchandising, so you always find a way to sneak in some new fine print, Nadia. I learned that the hard way 15 years ago. <laughs> okay. Can I leave now? Okay, yeah, I'm gonna leave now. So, yay. We believe in you. That we believe in you thing again. Interesting. 
Whoa! Hello! Whoa! Excuse me? Hi guys! How you doing? Having a nice night? Uh... <laughs> Whoa, buddy. Back up! I you gonna do that too? No? Yes? No? Um... Um... I'm gonna go ahead and push the button. See ya! Ha! Have fun! Quit staring at me, it's creepy! Oh dear. Oh! Oh! Oh, that's fun. That's... That's real pleasant. Um... Why do I get the feeling that that mannequin wasn't a mannequin at all? But, uh, but... Uh, huh? Ooh, you're spastic. Oh! Why so many Norwood ma puppets? Assuming puppets. Maybe mannequins? Check the bathroom real quick, because there's always something weird about the bathrooms. I've started to notice. Got the CD! Got... Ugh! Okay. Yay. Um... Yay. So, um, Mr. Bo... Mr. Bogart DJ, sir? I'm impressed you've made it this far, stranger. Few are as bold as you. Nadia can sweet-talk me all she wants, but I'm ready to go. The Modulo can have this place. Still, looking back, I never could quite put my finger on what drew me here. Hard to remember a time before I wasn't deep in the music at the Norwood Hotel. It's a place that attracts a certain kind of person. Let's put on some music to celebrate, shall we? Uh, sure, yeah, um... What about... does this... oh. Is that... Is that... The CD tray? Yeah! Okay. Okay, you're still going on about that line. Cool. Uh-oh. Here we go. Alright, so what... What's what 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 were we gonna hear you say? The turtle! Uh Bruce and his pet turtle. It never stops, does it? <laughs> Whatever, let's do this. Glutz know the turtle's alright though. It's that same song from Muriel. He was a robot? He was a robot. Hello! Um... Okay! <laughs> How you doing, Mr. Oldman? God... Wait... Um... No? No, I get it. You want a hug, but no. Don't hug me. I I don't want a hug. I'm not all touchy-feely like that. That smile is still creepy, sir. No. No. Bad touch. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, so, as far as I can figure, that's the end. Thank you for joining me on this journey in the Norwood Suite by Cosmo D. If you liked it, let me know by giving that like button a bop. Leave some comments down below and maybe, maybe we'll check out some of the other games that he's done. He's got, there's this game that uh, is called Stories from Off Peak that has my interest. And I, I found that before I found this and, and, uh, then heard that this is an, a game that came before it. So I was like... I should probably play that first. Regardless of that fact, I still never finished the the original Off Peak, which I could get back into maybe if I was persuaded to do such. Possibly. But that's if you guys want to see it. Let me know in the comments below if that also sounds like an appealing endeavor for you. 
if I could figure out what I was going to say next, I would love to know. If my brain could keep up with my mouth and my mouth could keep up with my brain, it would be nice. But, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, let me know by giving that like button a bop. Leave some comments down below, and I will see you in the next video. Hopefully, it'll amaze.